Hello, my dear NEET warriors. Welcome to the Unacademy NEET English channel. This is your physics educator, Captain Shreyas. Lot of you are worried. Am I doing the right thing by preparing for NEET? Am I neglecting boards too much? Okay, let me prepare for boards. After the boards, I'll take a drop and then prepare for NEET. Or maybe I'll take a crash course for two, three months and then I'll crack NEET. What happens if I give equal priority to both? Or how can I manage both these things? Which is more important? Is NCRT enough with PYQs? All these questions answered in this short video. But you have to stay tuned till the end. And also do me a favor by smashing the like button. That way YouTube will also know that you are a studious person. You are interested in academics or else it will send you distracting videos. So thank you for liking. And if you have not yet subscribed, please subscribe the channel. The fastest growing neat English channel in the country. And that too in English medium. Now, see, board exam is very important, but it is not sufficient enough to get you a seat in the medical college. It's more like a license. License to give the NEET exam, to go for the counseling, everything. Most of the colleges usually have 75% criteria, which is fairly easy to crack. Average student can also get 75% in the board examination. Trust me when I say this. Because I have been training kids for a long time. And you know, always I am proud about students cracking the NEET exam. A lot, not so much about the board exam. Even the students themselves say, Sir, I entered into AFMC, I got into AIMS, I got into this government medical college. And it's all because of NEET. They are very happy to see their pictures. Because they scored NEET all India ranks so and so. That's a natural tendency and that is what is right and that will help you in your career also when you become a big doctor or enter into some medical field. So NEET is your priority. NEET is something which you will be proud of. Remember, every future doctor's pride is NEET and even the doctors who are practicing, they will be proud of this examination. There are few things in boards which you need to cater to individually differently. Like when we talk about English, even if you study for one to one and a half months, that too through YouTube, and if you have been paying attention to your school or college lectures, more than sufficient. And I am not saying this, toppers are not saying this, these are average students, below average students. And I have seen every year, these below average students just study and that's it, they get good marks. Because, see, if you're listening to English music, listening to English movies, you're reading, writing things in English, you're conversing with your friends in English and attending, yes, English classes on this particular channel, then that's it. It will be very easy for you for those grammar-based questions, writing questions, reading comprehension questions. There's not much as memory-based. If you talk about the optional subject, be it physical education, geography, IT, they are very scoring. Last few weeks of preparation is enough. Solve the PYQs, listen to the classes in the school. That's it. More than sufficient. Okay. But if you have taken maths, then it might be a problem. You might have to take some extra help in maths, especially if you are not so good in maths. Because the 11-12 standard maths is actually good level maths. So unfortunately, if you have taken it, okay, then make sure you take some additional help only for maths. For PCB, you should not take any help. Whatever need preparation you are doing will be sufficient. In fact, see for PCB, what happens is you just solve the PYQs just few months or few weeks before the board examination. You will see a repetitive pattern in your school prelims also. You will see so many questions getting repeated here and there. So it will seem like a very familiar board examination. Just you have to prepare. If you go unprepared for the exam, then it is just lottery and luck. Then there is no point. If you prepare, then you will understand the pattern, the manner in which questions are asked, how much time you take, what strategy you need to apply. So study these subjects. And when you study, study it in tandem, meaning, for example, you are studying, let's say, magnetism. Study from NCRT, study from your NEET reference, practice NEET, PYQs, practice NCRT based questions, all of them together. Don't keep it separate. Do it once and for all, that way you will save time. Keep this in mind. Also, syllabus wise, NEET syllabus is higher, more in depth as compared to boards. So, when you are joining a NEET coaching, automatically you are preparing for boards. Because this is a doubt which many students and parents have. Oh my God, should I enroll in separate coaching? 
for boards not at all needed just do the things which i'm telling you more than sufficient you will get more than 95 percent marks in your board examination be it state be it cbc it doesn't matter a lot of students also ask is ncrt plus pyq is enough it is definitely not enough if you just practice pyqs and ncrt and go trust me you will not even get more than 450 marks in your need examination okay that will definitely not get you a seat you have to go a little bit deeper even for biology actually biology has the highest weightage ncrt wise chemistry second physics has the least weightage so you have to refer to the need books and i have made an exclusive video few days back on which are the best books for need please watch that video in case you haven't all right so that should answer your question that ncrt is not sufficient you have to go beyond ncrt for cracking need if you are aiming 600 plus 650 plus 700 these are the scores which will give you a college also in the school please pay attention to the teachers because they have experience in board teaching maybe not so much in need but they know how to train kids for the boards so listen to them and complete your school work in school don't bring it at home because at home you should use that time for need preparation and trust me you will find time to complete all your journals whatever homework in the school itself in the free period in between uh, the interval or whatever you will find time spend two to four hours in a week for exclusive board preparation pure ncrt pure board preparation that's all not more than that and as the exam approaches close then you slowly increase the time and when you are studying for boards what does it mean you have to practice the diagrams the charts the graphs experiments the procedures the derivations right the formulas the phenomena the reasoning the ncrt back exercise that's what you will do and it is doable you count the chapters you will see and when you do that write not read very important if you have the habit of just reading by hiding you will forget it during the board examination when you write it minimum two to three times remember this minimum two to three times you will feel so comfortable in the board examination you'll be like oh my god my pen is automatically moving this is so easy that's not me saying that's what the students say that is what I have been telling the students to follow because I have done the same thing when I wrote my board examination along with the entrances examinations so keep this in mind you don't have to go all in on boards nah right now the time is for you to prepare for NEET B24 or B25 NEET is your ultimate goal ultimate priority and if you have enrolled in coaching and you are happy with it very good i'm very proud of you and i'm very happy that you keep also watching my videos over here but if you're not happy with your coaching if you have not yet started preparing for need if you are a zero you feel answer really bad with these subjects i want to crack need i have taken a drop maybe this is my first attempt i don't know i'm very scared then trust me there are many students just like you in the batch that i'm teaching and these students have changed a lot in the last few weeks and months their perception only has changed and you won't believe it will feel like a magic and the magic is yet to completely happen because in the next few months i am going to train and nurture these kids to really become our future doctors the batch that i'm talking about is the neat energized batch which has live classes which has dpps mock tests which has all the doubt solving dedicated mentorship everything at one place you don't have to go anywhere and that the best part is you know it's in english and it's being conducted by we all the avengers team your same teachers and we know we are going to nail it and if you want to be a part of it please check out the link which is there in the description box it will give you the landing page you can register yourself do the payment use the avenger coupon code that's it you are in the batch and i would be very happy to see you tomorrow all right so that will take care of your need as well as your board examination that batch don't worry about it 
वन द कॉन्सेप्ट आर थरो नो बडी कैन शेक यू इन बोर्ड्स दीज आर माई वर्ड्स सो लेट्स क्रैक नीट लेट्स एम फॉर इट बिकॉज आई वॉन्ट टू सी यू इन दैट वाइट कोट आई वॉन्ट टू सी दैट स्माइल ऑन योर फेस नेक्स्ट ईयर I want you to come back and tell all these kids. Listen, I cracked neat. I did boards, and it was all possible. Even in the last few weeks, board preparation with the fundamentals of neat, everything was possible. I know you will say that. Thank you very much for liking. Please do not forget to share this video with your friends, with your batchmates. They will be benefited out of this. And yes, please subscribe to the channel as well. Thank you so much. This is Captain Shreya signing off. Assalamualaikum.